Anticipating and what was going on? Yeah, just anticipating, um, watching film and you know, going over the plays that they run. They ran a lot of step up screens, you know, side ball screens, and try to kick it back. So just anticipating that for a steal. Yeah, you guys, I think, in the first two games had six steals as a team. Yeah. Tonight you had 12 yeah. in one game. I'm wondering if there was a tipping point or something that turned the engine on, so to speak. Uh, I think just in practice, uh, coaches, both all the coaches have been honest about just rotating, uh, being more active, and not being late to uh, the rotation. So just you know, just working hard and you know, just coming out with more energy and being active with our hands. Cal said you all were doing drills on diving on the floor, wall sits. With yeah. players. What were, what's going through your mind when you're doing that? Uh, well, I think we deserved it after the Duke game and how we played uh, against <laughs> Southern Illinois. So I mean, you know, they're just being hard on us. And, want us to be better, they know how good we can be, so just stay down and know we hard. How long had it been since you'd done that in a practice? Uh, we haven't done the wall sits or anything all year, so. High school? Uh, yeah, I did in high school. How about the dive on the floor? Oh, yeah, school? I did that in high school. We didn't do that at all. Not, not yeah. Yeah. How, how much do walls? Is a shell shock of, of a game like that over I mean, I, don't, I know you guys didn't even see that coming from that. How do you shake something like that? Uh, well, it's a long season. Um, uh, credit to Duke, they're, you know, they're real good. Hopefully we'll see them again, but uh, like, like you said, um, or like I said, it's just a long season, so we're staying there to get better every day. How about your shot, uh, Tyler? Coach is still telling us he wants you, it sounds like he wants you to be prepared for the shot before the ball gets to you. Yeah. How, how much of an adjustment is that for you? Uh, so I'm working on it, um, mm -hmm. just staying in the gym, you know, just trying to make some shots here, but just like you said, he wants me to be ready. Uh, you know, compared to high school, where I can, you know, take five dribbles and shoot whenever. Now it's kind of you know, just being ready when the ball comes. Can you work on that by yourself? You know what I mean. It seems like you would need a partner to yeah. have yourself. Yeah, we got managers that can help us. How good does it feel to see the shot going down tonight? Uh, I felt good. Uh, I knew it would come eventually. You know, I see a lot of people freaking out like I haven't made a shot, but. <laughs> uh, I miss shots all, all the time, so it's, it's good. What was the biggest difference for you getting in a rhythm tonight versus uh, against Southern Illinois? Uh, I think tonight just being more active on defense and then not relying on my shots, more start uh, defense and you know, kind of just play with through the game, not force anything. What do you mean by freak out or people are freaking out? Uh, I don't know. I just see, you know, see a lot of people on social media and stuff like that. It's, I don't watch social media. Yeah. What, what, are, what are they doing or saying? Or? Uh, I don't know. People were just telling me. My friends were just telling me. I don't know what they were saying, though. I know your dad told you to stay off social yeah. media. Yeah, I wasn't after on the start. But, but <laughs> even but you have nice friends who like to, to, yeah, my friends to tell, tell you all the horrible <laughs> things that <laughs> people were saying on Twitter. Yeah. We kind of just laugh about it and stuff like that, but that's all right. Yeah, Devin Booker missed 15 of his first 20 when he was there. So. Yeah, so hopefully I he can get like right. him. <laughs> yeah, is there a moment, though? I mean,